What's up guys, this is Franco Mobile Homes and today we are gonna talk about pros and cons of mobile home parks or living in mobile home parks. This is where we show you the ins and outs and everything there is to know about mobile homes. It is truly our mission to transform lives through mobile homes. So thanks for watching Franco Mobile Homes. One of the pros is that you're not super close to neighbors or sharing walls as you do in an apartment, a condo, a townhouse, and you can hear your neighbor. Uh, like it's so easy to get a noise complaint and stuff like that. Another pro is that it's super minimal maintenance when it comes to your yard. It's not a huge yard, you have to do a lot of landscaping on and stuff like that. Another pro is that the location of these mobile home parks. People don't realize, but you should find out where these mobile home parks are because they're actually in very very key locations, at least for me, I feel like it's everything. You're able to get to work easier, you don't have to do a lot of commute time, and it puts off a lot of hours that you don't have to spend in traffic. Also on location, you gotta kinda look at where these parks are in. I mean, people have this whole stigma of mobile homes, but when you actually enter into a mobile home park, you'll find it's very much like a resort. Another pro is home ownership perks. So you can upgrade your home without having to worry, like if you were renting, you can paint it however you want. Uh, you can completely remodel it however you want. Another pro is community perks. So these include all the amenities that you get with the mobile home park, like a swimming pool that you don't have to take care of, uh, whether you have a shared basketball court or a shared playground. These are things that you have access to as a resident of the park and also they they host community events for the park residents too so another pro is that the cost of purchase is easier to get and less expensive compared to real estate so now let's go on to the cons one of the cons is you do have to follow uh, a neighborhood rule which is like the mobile home park rules it's very similar to hoa rules Sometimes they don't want random signs outside of your house. Uh, they pretty much want to make sure that your community looks to up to a standard. Uh, also, you're not disturbing neighbors uh, or anything like that. It, it's kind of like an HOA. Another con for some people is that you don't own the land. So the home is your land and you also are tied to your mobile home lease. To some people, they feel that's a really big con. But when you compare it to renting, it's a, a much more beneficial to uh, to own your mobile home on that lease. Another con is that that stigma that some people have to living in a mobile home park. And that's why we're trying to really showcase how sexy our mobile homes can be and how sexy it is to live in a mobile home park and how sexy it is financially to be in a mobile home. But you know, Hollywood does give us that stigma. So, Everyone has this eight mile trailer trash stigma when it's actually not out there in reality, especially in key areas like the Silicon Valley. So hopefully this was useful to you. And if you like our stuff, please like, subscribe. Uh, it really helps us out, comment, whatever it is. So thank you for watching guys. Have a great day.